Beloved British comedian Rowan Atkinson and Sinetra Shastri were happily married with two children for 25 years. That is, until he fell in love with another woman who was 30 years younger than him. The actor had to decide between following his heart or keeping his family together, and his decision was going to change their lives forever. I think that's indicative to me of a very selfish individual, which obviously I would claim that I was nothing like. Sinetra Shastri met Rowan in 1986 while working as a makeup artist for his co-star, Stephen Fry, in Black Adder. When Rowan spotted her on set, he was immediately attracted to her. In fact, he asked his co-star and good friend Fry if they could swap makeup artists so that Rowan could get to know her a little better. It didn't take long for a connection to form between the pair, and they were soon smitten with one another. The couple dated for about three years, and in 1989, Rowan got down on one knee and popped the big question. It's just one of those things that you do when you're very young and you think, you know, this is the way to do it. Sinetra was over the moon with their engagement, and a year later, they were married. Over the next few years, things were going well for the couple. Rowan's career was on the rise, and he was quickly gaining popularity for his comedy sketches. In 1993, the couple welcomed their first child, Benjamin. And just two years later, in 1995, they were blessed with a daughter they named Lily. Rowan and Sinetra were overjoyed with their new roles as parents, and with the actor's career gaining traction, things seemed like they couldn't get any better. Around the same time, Shastri decided to quit her professional career as a makeup artist so that she could focus all of her time on her children and the family. As the years went by, the couple remained fairly under the radar, and everything seemed perfectly fine with the Atkinson family. Unfortunately, everything changed when a new woman came into their lives. Rowan met fellow actress Louise Ford in Simon Gray's play, Quartermain's Terms, in 2013. At the time, Louise was around 32 years old, making her 30 years younger than the actor. She was also dating another comedian, James Acaster. As it turns out, despite both being committed to other people, Rowan and Louise couldn't stop themselves from falling for one another. After working together, Atkinson realized that he had fallen in love with her, and he had to make a decision. Was he going to do something about his feelings for Louise, or was he going to stay faithful to his marriage with Sinetra? While we don't know what happened behind closed doors, Atkinson either told his wife about the affair, or she somehow found out about it on her own. Whatever the case may have been, Sinetra was undoubtedly heartbroken about the fact that her husband had feelings for another woman. She wasn't going to tolerate Rowan's affair, and in 2014, she filed for divorce, citing unreasonable behavior as the ground. The divorce was granted in a mere 65 seconds, since Atkinson wasn't even present for the hearing in court. It was official. Rowan and Sinetra were no longer married. She also received a 10 million pound worth of mansion from her ex-husband as a part of the divorce deal. Rowan, on the other hand, moved into his four million pound London cottage. Sinetra was deeply upset to be replaced by such a younger woman, a source told The Sun. While the former couple never publicly commented about the affair, when the actor publicly started dating Louise shortly after his divorce, it confirmed what the rumor mill had been churning. Rowan had left his wife for another woman. His affair and subsequent divorce were criticized heavily by the UK tabloids. Rowan built his career on being a seemingly innocent comedian and family man, so when his fans found out that he had left his family for another woman, it changed the way they saw him. And it wasn't just his fans that saw the actor in a different light. His own daughter, Lily, shared her thoughts about her parents' divorce on social media. She described his behavior as a dick move, referring to the fact that her father started publicly showing his new relationship right after the divorce. It was clear that Lily was incredibly angry and disappointed at her father for his actions, and also proceeded to call her father a dickhead. Lily decided not to use her father's surname and adopted her mother's maiden name, Shastri. Their son Benjamin too didn't seem happy and shared that he was in no way interested in following in his father's footsteps. Benjamin went on to become a trainee officer. However, Lily did choose to follow in her father's footsteps and works as an actress known for her roles in movies like Johnny English Reborn, Mr. Bean's Holiday, and Tooth. Before Louise began publicly dating Atkinson, she gained a fair amount of attention for her role as Kate Middleton in Channel 4's The Windsors, a satirical take on the royal family. However, she was now beginning to draw a different kind of attention due to her very controversial romantic life. So, despite the harsh criticism Rowan and Louise were receiving from his family and the press, the new couple continued their relationship. They soon moved into the actor's £4 million cottage in North London. However, the couple did try their best to keep their romance out of the spotlight. They attempted to keep public outings to a minimum and avoided commenting about their relationship with the public. 
Before you think that their 30-year age gap was going to be an issue, it didn't stop the couple from taking a huge step forward in their relationship. In November 2017, Ford flaunted her growing baby bump while shopping in North London, confirming reports that Atkinson was going to become a father for the third time. The couple later welcomed their first child together, a daughter they named Isla Atkinson. Since then, they've done their best to keep their relationship as low-key as possible. The couple has now been together for around eight years, so it's only natural to assume that Rowan and Louise might be making plans to get married. While there has been some wedding buzz surrounding the couple, as far as we know, they don't have any official plans to get married. Yet. Perhaps Atkinson has no interest in getting married again after his first marriage failed, or maybe the couple is happy with the current status of their relationship. That said, there is every possibility that Atkinson might walk down the aisle with his beautiful girlfriend. For now, all we can do is wait until the duo makes any public announcements. On the other hand, it is possible that Rowan is avoiding a wedding because of how it may affect his first two children, Lily and Benjamin. While Rowan chose to follow his heart and end his marriage of almost 30 years to be with another woman, it's clear that his decision did some damage to his family and his reputation as an actor. We're not sure if he's been able to mend his relationship with his children, but perhaps he's taking this time away from the spotlight to fix things. We can't imagine how difficult the divorce and affair must have been for Sinetra and their kids, so we can only hope that they're able to heal from everything that happened and find happiness in their lives with their blended family.